Uh, I agree there's no use in shoving a definition down someone's throat without motivating it and understanding why we define certain things indeed right and by the way gang uh, the reason we talk about functions and, um, is is important right because functions are uh, about being able to make predictions right so when we're talking about functions it's extremely crucial in our world so for example one of the one of the things that I use to explain functions to my students is this right just imagine if uh, you know you're driving a car some some of my students drive a car some don't and I usually ask them do you know how how to drive a car or what the principle is they go yeah I go okay what happens when you sit in the car put the keys in the ignition turn on the car right and put your car in drive and put your foot on the gas right some people say the car moves some people say the car moves forward that's the distinction between a relation and a function those that say the car moves they're defining it as a being a relationship those that say the car moves forward they're defining it as a function because if they say the car moves they're not specifying in which direction does it move forward backward left right up down well if it moves forward or backward it's no longer a function because it's not predictable right it's predictable on those two planes but it's not predictable per exactly what it's going to do right so it becomes a relationship you put your foot on the gas and the car moves it becomes a function when you can make the prediction that it moves forward when you put your foot on the gas the car moves forward that is now function with that you can make predictions accurate predictions right